So what is going on everybody? How is everyone doing today? Daredevil 19 here and today I have some pretty cool action figure news for you plus at the end of the video I'm gonna give you a look at my upcoming figure reviews for August but for now let's start this video off here with the SH Figure Arts Battle Droid Geonosis color version. I think that's how you pronounce that. But he is going to be releasing this October. So if you want to army build this version of the Battle Droids, you can. And he is available for pre-order right now. So if you would like to pre-order this figure, now is your chance to. And this Battle Droid here is pretty much the same thing as the currently released Battle Droid. Just a different color. So I'm probably going to pass on this one because I passed on the... One that's already released, but it's cool we do get the C-3PO head with this paddle droid. And next here we have the SH Figure Arts Phase 2 Clone Trooper. And he is also going to be releasing this October, so this is another figure you can army build. And he is available for pre-order right now, so if you would like to get this figure, now is your chance to pre-order him. This figure does look dope though, and I did really like the Phase 1 Clone Trooper, but I did end up selling him. It's an okay figure, not the best that they made from their Star Wars line, but I think definitely worth picking up. Now moving on to the SH Figure Arts Stay Puffed Marshmallow Man from Ghostbusters, and this is going to be releasing January of 2017, so if anybody wants to get this, be on the lookout because he will be going up for pre-order very soon. I haven't seen him go up yet for pre-order. But uh, kind of random that they revealed this figure at San Diego Comic-Con, so I'm curious if we're going to get more Ghostbuster figures from uh, Tamashi Nations. Alright, so now moving on to the SH Figure Arts Sakura, and here's another image of her on display. And she does look dope. I'm curious when she is going to be releasing, but I'm more curious when the SH Figure Arts Rock Lee is going to be releasing, because this is... Pretty much a big fan favorite character. He's one of my favorites from the show, and he really needs to release ASAP right after Itachi and Sasuke. So very excited for those two in the Naruto line. So last here, we have the Variable Action Heroes One Piece, Nico Robin. And man, this figure looks amazing. Cannot wait for her to release, which will be this November. So very excited about that. And she did go up for pre-order. So if anybody wants to get Nico Robin, now is your chance to pre-order her. And it looks like from what I can see that Mega House did an amazing job with this figure, especially the sculpt work. But I do dig the accessories that we're getting with Nico Robin, interchangeable hands and faces. And then I love that we're getting interchangeable arms or if they're add-ons or something. I'm curious how that's going to work if you peg them in or if it's just a separate pair of interchangeable arms with the extra arms on it. But I'm uh, very excited for this one to release this November. But for now, that is all the action figure news I had for you this week. Now moving on to my upcoming figure reviews for the month of August. And right here is the Mafex, The Empire Strikes Back Boba Fett, which will be releasing this August. Plus, also releasing this month will be the SH Figure Arts Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Leonardo, and Donatello. I know they did have an early release at San Diego Comic-Con, but I wasn't able to get them. And also releasing this month is the SH Figure Arts Heavy Gunner First Order Stormtrooper. And the next SH Figure Arts DBZ figure to release will be Wee, so I will be reviewing him this month as well. And then last, we will be getting the SH Figure Arts Sage Mode Naruto, which this is probably the one figure I'm most excited for for everything releasing this month. But anyway, that is my action figure news video plus my upcoming reviews for the month of August. Hope you enjoyed my video. If you want to support the channel, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to share, and favorite the video too. And if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, just give it a thumbs up anyway because action figures are awesome. But thanks for watching. I will see you later.